Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for all Sun, Moon, and Rising Librans. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the 16th week of the year 2016, and the week begin from the 24th of April until the, 20th, the 30th of April. Please remember to listen to your Sun, Moon, and Rising sign, and remember to check me out at catticon.com. You can see the link below it is going to be a wonderful week because it's the energy vibration of the hurt energy which is the world the energy of the world is wonderful it's the ending of cycles and the beginning of new ones these are fantastic energies and um, it's going to affect everyone because when the energy of the world is the energy of the week it has an effect on everyone not only the earth people the hurt sign people but it has an effect on everyone what is so wonderful about this week is that um, the zodiac energy of also an earth energy and this is good so it's a balance it's a stable it's a balance week the end of April is just so wonderful because it's bringing balance and stability in everyone lives okay please remember to like shares these video thumbs up and I am going to look at your reading because <laughs> I've had it here it's wonderful um, you have wonderful wonderful energies because uh, um, you have on Monday and a lot of people it's going to have effect a lot of people a lot of situation a lot of people um, your focus is going to be the two of swords so your focus is going to be the two of swords so remember that it's going to be a week of balancing certain conflicts in your life. So you have the energy of the two of sword working there. So you have wonderful good balances. And I can't understand um, um, if you have these sort of a situation, you know, going to and from. But these are wonderful balances that come in. So these are good. As we look at Monday. And as I look at your week, the energy vibration in your week is all about new beginnings, new beginnings, victories, and new beginnings. As we look at the energy vibration, we have the Queen of Cups. And the Queen of Cups energy is wonderful. The Queen of Cups energy is a loving, nurtured energy. And this can be the energy vibration if your mom is a Queen of Cups, a Pisces, a Pisces, a Scorpio of... Um, uh, a cancer person connect with your mom in this week it's going to be wonderful as we look at Tuesday we have the earth energy vibration of the princess of Pentacles this is a wonderful energy a wonderful energy vibration to carry so for the people who are between the ages of 21 to 35 this is a good energy whatever is happening in your life and you're studying um, you're going to be a success you're going to pass your exams this is a good card to have especially in this week because if you're if you are about to take exams and that sort of a thing it's giving you the energy of a success coming in okay and it's good because um, um, the, the the energy of study and that sort of a thing have a different sort of energy vibration it's always wonderful it's always success and that sort of a thing coming in but yet still it's nice because you have wonderful energy vibration I'm sorry <laughs> we have in the middle of the week on Wednesday the devil the energy of the devil is here whatever is happening it is okay um, the devil energy is a fire energy and um, it has to do with a lot of stuff for some uh, when the devil comes up is uh, you know overeating that sort of a thing but yet still it's going to be good okay have no fear as we go on and we look at the energy on Thursday is a victorious energy is a six of one um, good news good information is coming in this is wonderful you uh, victoriously win something and overcome something in your life and this is going to be extremely wonderful this is going to be a fantastic time when we carry the energy vibration of this six of ones is always good news coming in okay for you um, liberals on um, Friday we have the ace of cups which is another wonderful energy the ace of cups carries a connection of wonderful people wonderful experience wonderful things around you 
um, love and this love is extremely good it is uh, um, from whatever has happened on Thursday this message of love that is coming in is going to be wonderful because it's coming in and it's good it's good love it's it's, it's not just the mere figment of a loss a lost situation but it is good love whoever you're connect with connecting with it's going to be good because I'm seeing the energy vibration of the Queen of Pentacles so and and this Queen of Pentacles is bringing you and connecting you with wonderful loving energies on uh, Saturday you have uh, the three of ones you're waiting you're sitting there you're 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 leaving something behind or you want to leave something behind and by doing that you're moving forward to something better in your life which is extremely good and extremely wonderful because life is about to begin and pick up for you and you're going to be understanding how certain things certain aspects work in your life for you okay as we look at Sunday we have the energy vibration of the Queen of Pentacles this is a wonderful good energy to have this person is very a very nice kind and yet still nurturing person maybe she is there maybe she is uh, supporting you maybe she is um, you know um, con continue to um, be there for you but yet still support you in wonderful ways the energy of this queen of uh, um, of Pentacles because there's two queen there's two queen border in your reading for some of you um, um, the queen of uh, cups could be um, your parents your mom or it could be your father and this is wonderful because for love in the sense of love and that sort of a thing it is connecting with your family the Queen of Pentacles is also here and the Queen of Pentacles is, is wonderful because it's a victorious success over something but yet still it's like it's as if your mom was sick and there is good news coming in and um, you know this is like extreme love from the universe saying that she will be better and um, this is the sort of energy that is coming up in this week also so love energy in this week is going to be extremely powerful use it to your best ability because if you do that you're going to understand and realize how powerful love is and that love can heal anything that is broken and uh, any relationship that you're trying to fight and figure out it it can be ill so this week for you guys is going to be a week of love but yet still the energy of the devil is here there's a little bit of loss going on also um, but it is it's, it's, it's okay I mean some people do have that you liberals especially liberal men always have this lustful effect so you know less with love yes yeah, sometimes from out of loss come love so you know this can be extremely wonderful for you guys so this is good so you know this is this is really a wonderful week because when you look at the energy vibration of these two queen and the energy of the Pentacles because for you guys money is not going to be a problem especially um, you when you're moving forward and you're trying to heal certain aspect of yourself and yet still certain aspect of your relationships uh, relationships with the mothers are going to be a very important so you have you have a relationship that is unbalanced with your mother and your mother is to say the um, Queen of Pentacles which is a Capricorn a Taurus or a Virgo or if your mom or father is a, a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion you're going to see that certain aspect and certain situation is going to come in because both of these Queens are here so what it is saying is that there needs to be an inner healing an healing of connection with your parents and your um, and, and, and by doing this this is going to help you to elevate uh, your situation whatever is happening in business and love we have uh, um, a good uh, aspect of this because we have the the um, 
princess of pentacles we have the devil and we have a victory and success good news is coming in so you know I love um, this is the only time when I love the energy of the devil because what it is doing is actually helping you to bring about wonderful new experience in your life because with the queen of pentacles and the devil and the six of ones that mean wonderful good news is coming in this good news is going to be about your financial situation but yet still you're going to um, start to elevate at the high energy vibration you're going to be very um, comfortable with where you are in your life and um, the space that you're you're dealing with and with the people around you so this is going to be um, extremely extremely good um, I am trying to find out um, there, there is a lot there's going to be a lot of connection with um, the the pentacle the people from the earth people and it is the earth week and your reading is so focusing on hurt people but yet still love in business and whatsoever situation that is going on in the business section I'm not seeing anything about work but in the business section remember whatever conflicts you have because this is the focus you're going to try to heal this conflict whatsoever that was there most of the time it is uh, um, innerly conflicts and this sort of a thing so understand where you are and how you can change certain aspects and certain vibration in your life and by doing that you're going to understand that you're on a journey and this journey is going to help you to focus yourself and see things much better I have one last card for you guys. <laughs> this is wonderful. Um, let me get my glasses on. And it says, I fully experience every moment and my life by living in the present. I fully experience every moment of my life by living in the present. I fully experience every moment of my life by living in the present the present so whatsoever is happening think about being in the present okay um, this week is all about focus in the present and I can understand why because you have uh, this energy of uh, um, these two people um, constantly going at it so this is going to be wonderful so be aware of that okay and I want to say namaste until next week.